intellectual property. People can't go out and create that same video game because it's considered a trade secret and the technology behind it, they've got patents, those kind of things. Yo, what's up guys, it's Kizal here and today we're back at it again once again with another video and this is a banger. Man was arrested. You hear me? A man was arrested selling Call of Duty World War II early. Like only, and the, the, the funniest part is he was selling Call of Duty uh, for $45. First of all, I got mad love for the guy. If you're the guy that was caught selling those copies early, dude, I wanna pr Everyone, let's actually, let's actually pray for him, alright? I hope you face nothing. I hope you get rewarded. I hope when you come out free, um, you get whatever you want. I, I hope. I wish. Of course, that has to be something positive, not something what you did right now. Of course, I got mad love for you, for the guy that was actually selling it, but at the same time, you shouldn't have stolen those copies, if you know what I'm saying. But, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> the, <laughs> this made a headline, man busted for allegedly, <laughs> cannot even pronounce, god damn it's one in the morning, uh, selling stolen copies of unreleased Call of, Call of Duty game for $45, and we're, we're gonna watch this. I have watched a little bit of it, but I wanted to kind of like record, get my reactions for you guys. DADC in Terre Haute ended up for sale on eBay. Now the man police say is behind those sales is in jail. Police started looking into this last Friday. We put News 10's John Swanner on the case. He explains how police say they were able to solve this crime. Patrice and Rondrell, this is a case unlike any I've covered before. Police say Deshay Tolls was selling copies of Call of Duty World War II. The only problem is this game isn't publicly released yet. Deshay Tolls faces a misdemeanor count of theft. He also faces a felony count of what's called offense against intellectual property. Police say Tolls was selling video games stolen from Sony DADC here in Terre Haute, and he posted the games on eBay. Police caught up with Tolls right next to the News 10 studios at 8th and Ohio Streets. Now, Tolls only made $45 per sale. That's one reason why we asked the Vigo County prosecutor why video games are considered intellectual property. People can't go out and create that same video game because it's considered a trade secret and the technology behind it, they've got patents, those kind of things. Now, according to court documents, Sony DADC has no record of tolls working for them, and court documents also did not spell out how tolls got into possession of the stolen video games in the first place. We do know that Sony DADC reported copies of this game as well as Madden 18. They were both stolen from the plant in early October. Tolls also has pending drug-related charges that will be filed against him next week. That's when he returns to court. Reporting at the Vigo County Courthouse, I'm News 10's John Swanner. Back to you. Damn it. But anyways, guys, uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys with probably not an early gameplay of Call of Duty World War II because people or man got busted, all right? But to be honest, dude, I got nothing but love for that guy because he was doing something. It takes a kind-hearted person to kind of like go ahead uh, and, and sell a copy that is worth around 60 bucks and I'm in Canada. It's worth like 80 bucks Like don't even ask me like god damn dude, but he was selling only for 45 bucks And honestly if I actually saw a listing for uh, for Call of Duty World War 2 early That was like around 45 bucks I would honestly think that it's not legit because normally it's gonna cost 60 bucks and then it's gonna be a little bit higher some maybe around 100 bucks or maybe even more because it's an early copy if you know what I'm saying so dude like I got nothing but love for for the guy he was doing <laughs> he shouldn't have steal though but uh i'm gonna pray for him tonight i i hope you face nothing dude i hope you face nothing i hope you get rewarded when you come on all right guys i'll see you very freaking soon